Alrighty guys, welcome back to the Best Investing Money Management channel on YouTube. In today's video, we are going to be talking about the top five stocks I am buying this August. So I hope you guys enjoy it. If you guys get anything in value out of this video, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions, ask them down in the comments. And guys, we do have new merch, so make sure you guys check that out. It's G. TFM. And if you're wondering what that means, it's get the effing money. So let's get it. I'll put that uh, down below so you guys can check that out. And guys, starting off with stock number one. Stock number one is Adobe, ticker symbol ADBE. And now the reason why I love Adobe right now is because it's down 25%. And the company is still absolutely killing it. They brought in about they brought in about five billion dollars. And for this stock that is killing it, increasing revenue, the revenue is up about 14% year to date, which is solid. Not to mention with a profit margin of 30%, meaning for every hundred dollars they bring in, they're profiting about thirty dollars, which is very, very high comparing that to Apple, which is right at about you know 20%. So they're doing very, very good. And looking at this stock, you'll notice the stock's gone from about $700 all the way to 411 with very solid earnings. The reason why we've seen sell-off from this is not because of anything bad going on with the company. It's just because of the market we're in. We've seen the S&P 500 just get obliterated, pretty much obliterated. And so this is just having some sell-off due to that. Um, so I think this is a great one here, not to mention you're buying on some support. So you're going to have a lot of buying pressure behind you. And it's just a good stock to have in your portfolio, guys. Now, moving on to stock number two. Stock number one or stock number two is Apple, AAPL. Beautiful stock, absolutely killing it on the on their last earnings. They brought in about $82 billion, which is solid. Plus, you're going to be getting about a 20, uh, 23 cent dividend, which is awesome. So you're going to get great great numbers you're going to get appreciation on the stock side with this up with this upward trend on top of that what you're going to get is some dividends to start compounding your account and i understand that a whole bunch of tech stocks lately have been getting just terrible earnings but apple is actually doing pretty decent um with that the stock's gone from about 180 bucks all the way to 161 hitting lows establishing heavy support here at 140 i definitely see this stock continuing to push back up to some highs here in the next couple of months and for me guys i always buy apple and it's just an absolute no-brainer investment dollar cost averaging this thing all day long i think we'll be hitting about one in the 170s by the end um, of next month, guys. So this is a great stock to have. Moving on to stock number three. Stock number three is ticker symbol WM. This is waste management. The reason why I love them is because whether the stock market's going up, down, consolidating, people need to throw away stuff and they need they need sewers and all of that other stuff that waste management handles. And the beauty of this is you're gonna be getting appreciation. So the general market has fallen about 20%. Waste management has fallen actually about 2%. So not as much, great stock. And if anything, this for me is just a very stable stock to have in my portfolio. You're gonna get some growth. You're gonna be getting some great dividends from this thing. The company brings in a lot of money, brought in about $5 billion, very, very solid earnings, right? You guys will notice 65 cents on that dividend. Hot, hot and solid earnings here, $4.6 billion, increasing revenue, all the stuff you wanna look at when you invest, guys. So the next one here, the next one here is J&J, &J, Johnson & Johnson, very similar to waste management. What we're gonna have is stability. We're not gonna have to worry about this. We're not gonna have to check this thing day to day. And with the market conditions we're in, we need stable stocks. And that's kind of what we've seen from Johnson & Johnson. You're gonna have some decent growth, you're going to be having some good earnings, right? Um, and on top of that, you're going to be having a dividend of $1.13 every single uh, quarter. So you're going to be getting growth. You're going to be getting uh, you know, appreciation. You're going to be getting dividends, passive income, all of that great stuff. So this one here, solid pick in your portfolio for, for to kind of balance out your risk. That's the way I always think of these value stocks. But now that we established a good growth stock like Adobe, established a solid stock, blue chip stable company, Apple. Then we have two of the value stocks. I kind of, on this last pick, I definitely went more towards growth. And this stock is ticker symbol 
V. Now this one here, for those of you that don't know, this is Visa. Visa is one of my favorite companies for a couple of reasons. The company brings in heavy money. On top of that, they have about a 52% profit margin, meaning for every $100 they bring in, they profit $52, which is extremely high. This is one of the highest profit margins out of any stock. And given the stock has sold off from about 250 to 211, absolute for sale sign for me to buy at a more affordable price. And looking at this thing, you'll notice it does have old resistance here at about $211, meaning that this old resistance, right? It hit it once, twice, three times, four times. This old resistance often acts as new support. So for me, buying at this 211 mark brings good and solid opportunities. But I think tides are changing and we've established some heavy, heavier support here at about 189. So we do have this new support and resistance line that I think everybody should know. So we definitely have a 211 to about 220 in the short term, but the long term is off the charts. Company brings in $7.2 billion. You're gonna be getting great earnings. You're gonna be getting a dividend and all of the things you wanna look at for your investments, guys. So top five stocks. I am buying. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button, subscribe. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments and we will see you guys later. Remember to stay happy, guys. Stay positive and stay safe out there. Take care.